A helicopter crashed into the roof of a hotel in the popular northern Australian tourist town of Cairns, killing the pilot and forcing the evacuation of hundreds of guests. Authorities said emergency crews were called at about 2 a.m. on Monday after a twin-engine helicopter collided with the hotel roof, causing a fire on top of the building and triggering evacuations. Uh, yeah, it was about uh, I think 2 a.m. in the morning. We just heard a bit of a uh, swirling noise, like a big whirlwind, and that was long event. I actually thought I was dreaming. Um, and then about two seconds later, there was like a very loud bang, a couple of bangs actually. The uh, room started rattling and the doors and everything and um, yeah, quickly ran to the kids. They were up screaming and yelling, what was that? I thought we were under attack or something. Uh, and um, yeah, we just walked out of the apartment and we saw there were some flames up above, just the hotel across the road, about 10 metres away. And uh, yeah, we were just asked to evacuate the building. Police said forensic investigations were underway to formally identify the pilot. He was declared dead at the scene. Um, so just before 2am QAS was called to reports of the hotel on fire after a helicopter had crashed into it. Uh, we had multiple crews attend. Um, once the, the scene was deemed safe, um, our crews were able to um, assess those impacted. Um, sadly, one patient was found to be deceased and two were transported to Cairns Hospital in a stable condition. The crash occurred at Hilton's Doubletree Hotel in the city of Cairns, a major gateway to Australia's Great Barrier Reef. Two of the helicopter's rotor blades came off and one landed in the hotel pool.